Where is she? Where's Clary? I guess they don't make a rune that avoids cancellation. Unfortunately, Shadowhunters has been cancelled by Freeform, so let's break it down. Hey, hey, you lovely people, Lisi here, and I'm sad to report that Freeform has pulled the plug on another one of their shows, Shadowhunters. And let's just say you all have a lot to say about it. I mean, you even got hashtag Save Shadowhunters trending worldwide at number one. One. The show just finished airing the first half of season three not long ago, and the back ten of season three, those episodes, have already been shot and will return now in the spring of 2019. Seems like quite a long ways away, right? Well, the news of the cancellation certainly came as a surprise. However, the cast will be able to get back together to bring closure to the show in the right way. Freeform has actually given the show a two-episode special finale to wrap things up, much like they're doing right now with the end of The Fosters. As far as the cancellation goes, Freeform said in a statement, We are very proud of Shadowhunters, a series that broke new ground in the genre world and became a fan favorite. However, along with our partners at Constantine, we reached the very difficult decision not to renew the show for a fourth season. But as big supporters and fans ourselves, Freeform insisted on and championed the filming of a special two-part finale that would give devoted fans a proper ending. The 12 episodes will air in the spring of 2019. We want to thank our talented creators, producers, cast and crew, along with our colleagues at Constantine for their hard work and dedication, and to Cassie Clare for her incredible book series. We look forward to the final chapter of this breakthrough drama. Also, according to the Hollywood Reporter's sources, much of the reason for the cancellation is that Constantine lost its output deal with Netflix, which distributes the show internationally and helped pay a lot of the bills for the expensive show. That meant that they needed more money for Freeform, and unfortunately Freeform couldn't foot the bill, so they couldn't keep the series running. As far as the two-part series finale goes, according to just Jared, it will follow the sixth book, the final book, City of Heavenly Fire. As much as the cancellation came as a surprise to us, the fans, it was also a surprise to the cat. Catherine McNamara, who plays Clary, tweeted, We just found out too, and believe me, we are as shocked as you. Truly, this show has been a treasure. Playing Clary has been an honor and a joy. Thank you for entrusting her to me and coming on this journey with us. She also continued to thank the cast and crew and, of course, the fandom. She said, The love this fandom has for the source material the show, the artists, and for each other is a force to be reckoned with like nothing I have ever seen before. No matter what happens from here, I promise you this, by the angel, we will make the most rock-solid, badass, magical finale you could imagine. Our beautiful Alec Matthew Daddario tweeted, It has been an absolutely wonderful experience getting to be a part of Shadowhunters for the past three years. After all of it, I hope I have fulfilled my promise of being the best Alec Lightwood you could ask for. I would say he has. He, of course, went on to thank the cast and crew and promised some awesome episodes coming up as well as, well, pictures of birds. Harry Shum Jr., aka Magnus, aka the other half of Malik, wrote, First, I want to say thank you to all the incredible fans from all over the world. This has been an amazing journey being a part of Shadowhunters and to have the opportunity to play the incomparable Magnus Bane. He also wrote, You all have been so supportive and it's been inspiring to read your tweets, comments, and letters, pouring your hearts out on how much the show means to you. I am honored to be a part of that. Our Izzy Emerald simply wrote, we love you all, thank you, with a screen cap of Save Shadowhunters trending number one. David Castro, who played Raphael, tweeted, it was a great ride. I was so lucky to have met slash worked with such an amazing cast and crew who I will truly miss. I love you all and thank you for letting me be your Raphael Santiago. Valentine, aka Alan Van Sprang, added, though I'm not on it anymore, it was a great journey and worthy of years and stories to come. Really upsetting. Now Dom, Isaiah, Alicia, Alberto, and some of the others from the cast have yet to react, but it pretty much sounds like everyone is saying the same thing. They're pretty shocked, but grateful for the experience and especially grateful for the amazing fandom that these books and this show have. Now since Netflix pulled their funding internationally, it looks like they're not going to be part of the ones to save the show, so maybe Amazon or Hulu you can uh, pick it up or something? It does seem like it's quite an expensive show though, so I'm not quite sure what the odds are of that happening. Either way, just keep speaking out on Twitter, though. It seemed to work for shows like Timeless and others, so you never know. While it is a bummer, we still do have those 12 episodes left coming next year, and while we have to wait quite a while, hopefully that means the show will film, film those last two episodes, and it will be an awesome, amazing family with the uh, closure that it deserves, because sometimes when shows get canceled, and by sometimes I mean the majority of the times, you don't get the closure you need. You don't get those extra special episodes, so I'm glad that they are doing that for this show. Now it's your time to sound off in the comments. Are you sad that Shadowhunters has been canceled? What are you going to miss most about this show and what do you hope happens in those back 10 episodes and then the two part series finale? Weigh in then check out my recap of the first part of the three part Foster series finale 
right over here or a rundown of what happened in the first half of season three of Shadow Hunters. Be sure to subscribe, hit that thumbs up, and uh, yeah, thanks so much for watching, guys. We still have time to talk about Shadow Hunters together, so let's just look forward to that, unfortunately, in 2019. Still a while away, but it'll happen. Thanks for watching. See you again soon.